everybody. I'm here with my friend, composer Randy Wolf. Hello. And uh, he is here in my home in Pickerington, Ohio today because we're getting ready to go down to Marietta, Ohio, where the River City Symphony Orchestra is playing his new flute concerto, The Angel of the Odd. Uh, I'm really excited about that performance. And I wanted to take this opportunity to talk with Randy about his flute and electronics piece, The Line of Purples, off my upcoming album, Returning to Heights Unseen. So thank you for coming and hanging sure, out with me, pleasure. Randy. Thank you for dying your hair purple. <laughs> happy, to, happy to help. So talk to me about The Line of Purples. Well, I guess the place to start would maybe be the title, mm -hmm. which, like many of these titles, is more sort of imaginative and doesn't really have that much to do with the piece specifically, but I, I like reading a lot about the brain, about vision, how the vision system works and so forth. Is there are a lot of illusions and it's just interesting to know how much our mind makes up of what we see. It turns out it's almost everything, especially regarding color. And the, the color purple, as distinct from violet, doesn't actually exist outside of the human mind. It's when you see something that's red and blue, your mind has to make up this thing purple to distinguish it from the center of the spectrum. But I was interested, especially you know, writing a piece for you after we worked together for so much, right. or rather for so long, and I guess I wanted to create sort of an electronic folk music that never existed to take elements. There's some, I think, Burmese music or something in some of the samples to try and create a very ritual, almost like Neolithic and early human civilization world, although despite the fact that I'm using the electronics, and I guess maybe that's the illusion. And the other thing I really find fascinating about the piece is how you blended so many worlds. So you have some world music elements in the track, you have the science element in the idea of the piece, mm -hmm. and then it's sectioned into different movements, as it were, that are all titled after Baroque dances. So old meets new. Well, and coming to, like a lot of composers around my age, I came to classical music pretty late, coming out of popular music. And I really love the Bach suites, the keyboard suites, the French suites, and the English suites. And I guess all those terms were new, except from hearing them in uh, square dances when they talk about alamans. I really sure. Um, that just it always seemed like a charming fantasy thing to me. These alamans, corans, paspiers, jigs. So I'm not sure. That I don't think any of these pieces are really like those. The pavane is just is like a pavane. Absolutely. But um, yeah, I think I now wanted to have an, a, a little. Something I've always wanted to do is to make a sweet track. Album. And then there's also just some really great beats in the track. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> so talk to me about your influence there. Well, one of my great loves in music is, is hip hop. And there's different pieces of mine that have it to varying degrees. I don't think I have anything that sounds like out and out hip hop you turn on the radio. But I think it's without a doubt the most imaginative and creative music, especially happening today, especially in the past three or four years. There's a circle of people around Kanye West, yeah. Chance the Rapper, and Kendrick Lamar, and the producers involved with them that are just incredible. So it's just, uh, I guess, wanting things you see on the shelf at the store. I hear, I want to do that, I want this in there, and to, to bring those in. Well, thank you so much for talking to me about the thank piece. You. I hope that everyone enjoys this really special work as much as I do. You'll be able to hear it on my new album, Returning to Heights Unseen, coming out May 11th on Parma Recordings. And you can support the effort to uh, release that album at the Indiegogo crowdfunding campaign here. Thanks so much, Randy. Sure, thank you. Bye, guys. Bye-bye.